Hey team, welcome back and thanks for joining me if it's your first time here. Now today we've put together a brief tutorial aimed at helping you simply add your email signature to Gmail. Now this is a straightforward process and after I will share some tips for creating your amazing email signature. Okay guys, now just quickly before we go ahead and dive into Gmail, consider subscribing if you haven't done so already and that way you'll stay updated with actionable videos and tutorials designed to equip you with the skills, knowledge and tools to grow your small business online. And with that happy note, let's go ahead and add your email signature to Gmail. Okay, so how can we actually go ahead and add our email signature to our Gmail account? Well, firstly, what we need to do is log into our Gmail account and then just simply navigate up to settings on the top right and then under general settings, so general should already be selected, navigate down the page until you find signature. So here we have the signature down here. What we want to do is actually go ahead and create a new signature. So currently we have no signatures on this account. So I'm going to click create new. Then here simply name your email signature. Now you can actually create multiple email signatures within Gmail and you can select and change them when you like. So go ahead and name your signature for your own reference. For this email signature, I just added my name. Then come down and click create. And as you can see over here, we can go ahead and create multiple email signatures if we like. We currently have our first email signature called Stuart Gould. We can edit over here, so it's already selected. We can start editing over on the right hand side. And we can also delete this email signature if we like. Now over here is where we can actually go ahead and edit, customize and actually develop our email signature. So if we navigate down here, you can see that you have formatting options available if you decide to create your email signature here. However, what I recommend is you head over to Design Hill and create your free email signature with their email signature generator. Now what we're going to do is quickly head over to Design Hill and show you our email signature that we've just created. So here we are on Design Hill. Now this is a great design tool that you can use to quickly create your free email signature. As you can see down here, we've already gone ahead and created our email signature. All I need to do is navigate down here and click copy signature. And then I'm just gonna leave a quick review and then click submit. Now, if you haven't actually created your own email signature and you'd like to learn how to create your own email signature like the one we've got here, then feel free to watch our beginner's tutorial up above, which will guide you through the process to create your free email signature with Design Hill. So we'll pop that up above. So what we're going to do now, because we've already gone ahead and copied our email signature, is head back to Gmail. And then back here in our Gmail account and next to signature, what we're actually going to do in this formatting area here is paste that signature. And as you can see, we've gone ahead and pasted that email signature in the space provided. Now I want to get rid of this branding down here, create your own email signature because I don't want this branding on our email signature. So I'm going to click delete and I'm happy with that email signature there. Now, like I mentioned, you can use Design Hill to create your free email signature, or you can just simply use the formatting options available down here. However, I recommend using Design Hill because it's quick, it's easy, and it's already formatted. So for example, when you send an email to multiple different email types, so for example, Gmail, Outlook, any other email client, sometimes your email signature can be unformatted and look very strange in other people's inboxes. However, with Design Hill, your email signature has already been completely formatted and you're not going to come across those issues. So once you're happy with your email signature, I'm happy, navigate down to the bottom and click Save Changes. Then as you can see, we're back in our inbox. What I'm going to do is navigate up to Compose and then down here, you can see this little pop-up message here, easily switch between different signatures. And if you click on this pen icon here, you can go ahead and select your email signature. Now, if you have multiple, you can select the email signature that you want to use in your email, or you can go back to manage signatures, and that's going to take you back to the dashboard we were just in to recreate and design your email signature. So we're going to go ahead and click Stuart Gould. And as you can see, I have my email signature here, and I'm happy with that. And I can go ahead and compose my professional email with my 
awesome email signature that I just created that's professional and formatted. So as you can see, it's very straightforward to actually add and create your own email signature and add that in Gmail. And there we have it guys, that is it for this tutorial. Now if you have any questions about email signatures, make sure to pop them down below. And with that said, thank you so much for watching this tutorial all the way through to the end. If you got value, make sure you leave a like and a comment down below and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And that way I'll see you in the next video. Take care guys and happy new year.